aboard the steam ferry Berkeley today to commemorate a blockbuster movie about the world's most infamous shipwreck. I'm the king of the world! Titanic won 11 Academy Awards after its 1997 premiere. Iceberg, right ahead! 25 years later, we sat down with three of the film's extras. Well, these are our crew jackets that we bought during filming. Judy Prestoninzi, Ellen Mower, and Don Lynch are Southern California residents who participated in the six-month shoot. I played Frederick Spedden, a first-class passenger. Welcome to the... Studios. The extras commuted to Rosarito, Mexico, where writer-director James Cameron recreated the full-size exterior of the Titanic. We've got the wreck. We know what it looks like. We've been there. We photographed it. The largest set in film history was placed in a 17 million gallon tank about the size of two football fields and then flooded with 52 degree ocean water. And when they would start sinking that set, you were going down into 40 feet of water. Judy and Ellen both played Titanic casualties. Some jerk <laughs> swam over me and dunked me. Ellen didn't know until after the shoot. It was Leonardo DiCaprio. And I looked at him and he looked at me and says, oh, I'm sorry, I didn't know you were real. And I said, that's okay, I've been told I played dead well. <laughs> we shot our interview aboard the steam ferry Berkeley which is a floating museum. Apparently she wore a long black gown. Kevin Sheehan, long the curator of the Maritime Museum, showed me a shawl with a direct connection to the Titanic. This was worn by a Titanic survivor, Constance Chaffee, as she escaped in lifeboat number four on the night that the Titanic actually sank. You have a gift, Jack. I really didn't know who Kate and Leo were when we went down there. But by the end of the shoot, they all did. Judy even shot a scene with Winslet that was cut from the movie where they wrestled. Jim wanted me to like claw at her face and he says, let me see your fingernails. And I went like this and they were kind of long. I said, I can bite them off. <laughs> you know, because he didn't want me scratching her. Judy, Ellen and Don never dreamed the movie would become a classic. It's such an incredible story. And that they'd become lifelong friends. You survived Titanic. And we're part of its history. In the Zevely Zone, I've got you. Jeff Zevely, we'll let go. CBS 8.